The day first of road trip in Austria, vlog number two. Me and Gandalf the Rainbow are heading back to the bottom of the mountain and the problem is we run out of water. During this hike, if you haven't seen the first part, here is the link. Check that first and then come back to the second part so you will be familiar what was happening but during this hike we made so many mistakes with Gwen hiking with sleepers wearing skirt not bringing enough water and what we are thinking right now if it's good idea to refill the water from those mountainous streams which are coming down everywhere and drink it if it's safe or not I will try to refill the bottle Gwen said she will not drink that, she will rather wait uh, to drink the water which is in the car and I will see if I will suffer the rest of this road trip sitting in the CR with diarrhea or not. Stay tuned with us guys with my crazy adventure Lord of the Rainbows. So now Jacob is going to fetch the water. More. How was it? No! Look, go! Put your feet away! I'm gonna drink it! It's fine. It's good, delicious. The water is good. How's the water? Cold. Is it better than water in the store? It's very different. Like a smoother. Fresh? Smoother, smoother fresh. I would say the fresh feeling is only because of that it's cold but oh, it's fresh the same taste water I had before in the village mm. we're fetching water from the tree Gwen decided she wants to make those shortcuts because <laughs> she's lazy to walk <clears throat> I chose to have that safer but little longer way and still for me it was longer distance and I'm here first with less risk of injury when we were in the Philippines with Gwen once we did hiking there as well to the highest mountain in Cebu Island and what's the difference we arrived to the half of the mountain by motorbike and then we continued walking but we had to rent a guide or we had to buy a guide a boy who was accompanying us to the top of the mountain and showing the road and it was like 1500 pesos double suffering you have to pay and still suffer the walking but here in Austria you are just suffering walking, walking. and being stupid <laughs> and what we were really stupid because when we were in Cebu of course there is the mountain and the mountain has two sides the one side is that side we went with Gwen where you have to pay if we would go from the other side there is no payment because that's not really that famous and beautiful road but the result is the same you will still reach to the top of the mountain I could see one vlogger doing that we woke up not only two of us in this room but three and it's crazy. Yeah. And you know what? It's crazy because I have a man here with a big body with a big arms, but scared of mosquito. Right? Very I would, scared of mosquito. I would never, I could never kill that. Or... It's just a mosquito, but he's so scared. Oh, they're so insecure in the room. I am. I have to get rid of it. I have general phobia of insects. So. But the bees. Not really. I was working with bees. Bees are fine, friendly fellas, but every other thing with six or eight legs, never. What kind of? If you will slap it, the color of that will stick to the paint. <laughs> but another day, <laughs> another morning, we are getting ready for the hike. Today's better outfits with shoes both of us better outfits with shoes yeah 
Uh, bug bugs with water and yeah. all the equipment needed. Snacks, please. I'm hungry. And we are heading out somewhere. And also today we don't have really a plan, I guess. <laughs> okay. We are very random people. <laughs> While looking at the countryside of Austria, I feel like I am inside of a painting. Like, I've never seen such kind of a countryside which is very beautiful before I thought Czechia has the most beautiful countryside now I changed my mind after seeing Austria <laughs> our goal for today is to visit waterfalls but the problem here is that we chose cloudy and rainy days Kubo found the NSIC transferred to our car. <laughs> How did it get there? I don't know. Maybe it's, uh, I don't know. There's a magic. Or, or maybe the NSIC is giving us a revenge from killing us, from killing it. So it's getting inside of our car. <laughs> we just came from the Lidl and we have our things with us, our foods. It's time to eat our breakfast. Oops. Kuba was already yawning earlier. Whoa! <laughs> He's very hungry and is also very quiet. Me too. Enjoy! Enjoy! We just arrived to the heart of Kaprun, the destination for skiing in the Austrian Alps surrounded by the mountains in the valley and I'm waiting for the instructions where are we heading to? my guide looks confused house everywhere, bells are ringing that's the Austria your friends are there yeah yeah? <laughs> <laughs> hey do you know where Sigmund Wasser falls? we are lost do you know there or here? Where's the direction? There or here? Hey! <laughs> Not answering me! There? Okay, thank you! Bye! <laughs> These blue waters, clear waters are crazy. It looks like somewhere in Bali or Indonesia on those pretty beaches but no we are in austria yes what's that color color what? it's not blue but it's turquoise turquoise we were quite sad because it's sunday today and we were expecting there will be so many people around all those famous spots but maybe because the weather is not really good today there maybe will not be that many people so we will see yeah. for now it looks like not many why do you think the water can be that blue? is it? that's all? oh, are you disappointed? yeah, it doesn't look crazy we'll see wait for it it will be Price. Maybe worth it. It's quite steep here. So get the sandals you had yesterday. <laughs> here we approach this place. The glacier Polish. This whole place is a water dam and it's overflowing down there. Oh. Oh. We have to get down there somehow. Oh my gosh, I can already see many people. Now what? Gwendy is buying the tickets and we can go on the trail. Fascinating. Fascinating. The guy was a smiling face. Yeah. 
it means we are funny to people so here it is beautiful beautiful and the entrance of Sigmund Fan Club and as you can see guys it's so awesome very nice Oh my god, how could this be? First activity of today is done. I experienced it so bad. I felt like a little bit of adrenaline <clears throat> because I was imagining jumping there to the water from those bridges and dying after. You're <laughs> but really I really want to go <laughs> into those waters and everything. That made me to one idea to find a place here in Austria where is canyoneering done because once in the Philippines we experienced that in Kawasan Falls so why not to try it here in Austria canyoneering I'm having a second thought on <laughs> that because I don't know how to swim and when we did it in Bajan I was so scared yeah. but in Bajan Gwen was wearing that safety and we West? had a tour guide who's making us more safe. Oh. But if there's a canyoneering here, I'm not sure if there's a tour guide. For sure. And if not, I will be one. <laughs> we parked the car here next to the city. And the next place Gwen picked visiting a lake. Lake for swimming, it's Zil Am. Zell MC. The trees are bigger than you. Yeah. You can hide. There is a throne for you. There is throne for Gwen. Look guys. Size of Gwen with comparison with the size of the trees. Crazy. Are you touching him down there? Yeah. Hey. Morning wood. <laughs> You're so bastos. It's really nice guys if you if you are really here. In that area is very nice view, especially if it's sunny. For sure it's really clear through the video. But since because of the gloomy weather you can't really see it properly. <laughs> oh, oh. He's drawing his shoes to the water. <laughs> Crazy Jacob. Ding da -de ding the waterman. <laughs> uh, cold? Is it cold? Arrived to our last 
destination trip for today which is in Grimler Wasser Falls so I think we need to walk on at least an hour and 30 minutes for us to arrive there we will see all our body hurts from yesterday and we will make it more painful today mm -hmm. <laughs> and tomorrow <laughs> But at least it's gonna be a good sleep later. Oh, good for you. You can sleep. Because me, when my body, my body hurts, I cannot sleep. Get drunk. I'm having a hard time. That's Get medicine drunk. for good sleep. <laughs> That's a very good advice. Get drunk. Mm. Yeah, and it works. Very good advice. Personally, <laughs> experience. I always go personally. Personal experience. But yeah. when I experience, I cannot sleep, I guess. Ready? Steady. Set. Ready, set, steady, go! Me and Gwen were thinking to purchase a drone just like here a couple has to have very nice shots and it would be amazing to have it here in Austria this time that's what we made a mistake about maybe next time look at the Filipino hiker look at her the tiniest hiker ever Tiniest hiker going to climb uh -uh. the highest mountains. Uh huh. My gosh, <laughs> I think two hours of walking. Ah, easy. Easy. <laughs> to supanorama ta co mamo? Huh? You see that little guy? Oh! Oh! It was eating, but you're starving it. That's amazing here in Austria. Those streams. Oh, yeah. Cold? Ah, cold and refreshing. Yeah. Swimming pool? Yeah. Swim then. Uh, <laughs> oh, it's closed here, baby. Oh, closed road. So, my navigator. I don't know. We just crossed the entrance, we had to pay for the tickets 16 euros? Yeah, for both 16 euros for both and finally we can continue on our path Quite expensive Gwen is not happy because <coughs> she thinks it's expensive <laughs> But tourist destinations are like that Right here we are under the waterfalls Oh my gosh wow. The water here is very angry yeah. It's not cold waters Crazy. Let's come closer <laughs> So me with Gwen are done with our midday shower very refreshing, the little tiny bubbles or drops, drops are falling on you. <laughs> the water drop. is kind of very cold, but when the <laughs> drops are such a little, it feels like amazing, refreshing a lot. But cold. just, let's say, three minutes, we were there, yeah. all wet, <laughs> all around. We will change the clothes and we will transfer to the upper part of the waterfall because yeah. this is not the end guys the biggest nightmare for Gwen is appearing another zigzag road <laughs> ready? <laughs> ready? <laughs> there's, there's always zigzag, zigzag places here well you can go straight away but I guess it will be much much exhausting than zigzag this proves that I'm not a hiker uh, you are. I'm not. We both are hikers, though we don't look like them. I set a safety brake because Gwen is becoming tired after all day of hiking. It's currently 3.30 p.m. Yeah. Gwen's having urges to pee, but so many people around. 
it doesn't look like but there are still people passing but still we are not in the end of this way we there is still a long way forward to reach the tops crazy Jacob. and on the top there is another way to the lake lake no yeah no baby i'm even hungry right now we haven't eaten lunch yet our lunch was the 16 euros we paid for the entrance mm. and the thing which is going through <laughs> our minds those whole two days we are here in austria yeah like all the time people looking at us like but really all the time head to foot foot to head and not only gwen this time even me yeah. like if you guys will be that kind and you will share with us to the comments what is so weird about us? us because that's really like <laughs> like i would say it's not about our outfit either because we are wearing proper hiking have they never seen asian and white boy i guess together i don't know <laughs> but it's so crazy like people are really looking at me like with like eyes wide and like they are really not like embarrassed or scared to really look at you like i i, I whenever i notice that i also do that to them because it's so annoying like why are you looking at me okay i'm gonna look at you at two yeah that's our revenge <laughs> that's our defense <laughs> i saw they stop looking <laughs> we just arrived to the top of the waterfalls but i'm excited and gwen is disappointed because there is another waterfall and we have to make it to the real top oh no yeah Crazy. it would be Kitty not to go there. The plan of going uphill for the other waterfalls is cancelled because according to the weather it's going to rain harder and we still have an hour to go hiking downward and we don't have raincoats Jacob will be wet too and like me I have my jacket which is waterproof so we need to go back before the rain starts falling I mean it's already started falling but it's just little drops but later it will be too much this trip is actually worth it and I'm so happy that I pushed Jacob to come here in Krimler, Krimel waterfalls because it's beautiful one of the most beautiful stops or spots we've ever visited since yesterday i hope you guys enjoyed our video and stay tuned for more adventures with us expect that we will upload more videos and thank you so much for tuning in see you again next time and if you like this video you may hit the like and of course subscribe button see you again next time bye Ha, 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 ha.